Hi, I'm Dr. Jack Eisler, and today I want to speak to you for a couple minutes on a book by Lee Hall called Stopping Kidney Disease. <clears throat> I was a physician practicing clinical critical care for almost 35 years. Many of my patients had kidney disease and ended up having kidney disease after being very sick. In this book, Lee Hall attempts to give perspective of a patient with kidney disease to a patient with kidney disease. <clears throat> In the book that Lee has, Stopping Kidney Disease, <clears throat> he tries to educate the patient, <clears throat> tries to help them see how they can help themselves. This book has 42 chapters, over 500 pages, and over 700 references. Don't let the size of this endeavor itself keep you from reading this book. Each chapter stands on its own. You can read it in very short increments and be able to understand and then add your understanding to each chapter that you read. It doesn't even necessarily need to be in the order presented in these 42 chapters. <clears throat> As you read through it, you will be able to additively tell a story of how the kidney disease that you have potentially could get better. There is a distinct gap in modern medicine, but dealing with resolving issues with disease processes and educating the patients about their disease process, in particular when it comes to kidney disease. Lee Hall attempts to present ideas about how patients can help themselves <clears throat> and stay within medical bounds at the same time. So either your practitioner isn't going to be upset that you're trying to help yourself. Patient is con continually connected to his medical provider and does not reach beyond the literature that is presented in the book. This is a must read for patients who have failing kidneys of any kind. They're particularly related to the kind that Lee Hall had, it may help the most, but overall, if you have kidney disease, you should read this book. Again, it's called Stopping Kidney Disease. The author is Lee Ho. A patient armed with knowledge of the disease process has a higher possibility of healing. Again, do not be overwhelmed by the size of this work. Lee's work is well done, well presented, and can be read by almost anyone. You should have this book in your library. You should read this book if you have kidney disease. <clears throat>